Hey guys, welcome to this Simple Nursing mini lesson, the series where we take big, intimidating nursing topics and make them, well, simple. If you're tired of staring at your boring textbook, wondering if you'll ever understand this information, well, remember, our full nursing school membership is built to help you break down complex concepts, study smarter, and pass nursing school with confidence. All right, today we're tackling something straight out of the Fundamentals of Nursing playbook. The four nursing meta paradigms. These are the big picture building blocks of nursing theory. And if you can understand them, then you can connect just about any nursing topic to the bigger why behind it. Think of them like four legs of a table. If one's wobbly, then the whole thing shakes. These four legs are person, health, environment, and nursing. First up, let's talk about person. This is your patient, but not just the patient chart, diagnosis, and vital signs. It's the actual person. This concept sees the patient as a whole human being, physical, emotional, social, and even spiritual. It's the idea that we don't treat the disease, we treat the person who's living with the disease. That means respecting values, culture, and beliefs and involving their family or support system when it matters most. You see, if you only treat the illness, you miss the entire person. And in nursing, that's a big no-no. Next is environment. This is everything around the patient that affects their health. The physical space, the social setting, the cultural background, even political and economic factors. It's the reason why you notice if the patient has three flights of stairs, and no elevator before sending them home with a set of crutches. It's why you consider if they have access to healthy food or if they're living in a noisy, unsafe neighborhood that affects their recovery. Environment is not just about hospital room versus home. It's every factor, big or small, that can help or even hurt their health. Speaking of health, number three is health. Health is not just not being sick. It's the patient's total well-being, physical, mental, and social. We look at exactly where they're at on the health-illness continuum and help them move toward their best possible level of wellness. Sometimes this means curing a problem, but sometimes it means helping them manage a chronic condition, as well as adapt and still live their life to the fullest. Now, finally, we have nursing. This is us. This is our knowledge, skills, compassion, and the way we actually deliver care. It's all the roles that we play. Caregiver, educator, advocate, and even team player. And it's not just about knowing how to do a procedure, but also why we do it. And last, but definitely not least, doing it with empathy. Nursing is the glue that holds these three concepts together. Without it, person, environment, and health just sit there on a piece of paper. But with it, we bring them to life in real patient care. So to wrap it up, person is who we care for. Environment is where and what surrounds them. Health is their overall well-being. And lastly, nursing is what we do and how we do it. So here's the secret. These four paradigms aren't just theory. They show up every time you make a care plan, prioritize interventions, or even answer NCLEX questions. The better you understand how they're connected, the easier it is to think like a nurse. So if you want to keep making these aha moments in nursing school and actually remember what you study, check out the full Simple Nursing Nursing School membership. We've helped well over a million students not just survive nursing school, but graduate with confidence. And that wraps it up for our mini lesson on four nursing paradigms. See you guys in the next one.